Hey everybody, Ultimate Oddball here. Today I'm going to discuss some of the benefits of the autistic brain. Due to stigma and a generally negative narrative surrounding autism, as well as the difficulties which often accompany it, it's not uncommon for the positive aspects of autism to be glossed over. Due to the inherent variability in how autism presents, the information here will neither be exhaustive nor applicable to everyone, but should still nonetheless provide a different perspective. Most people are aware that some autistic individuals are referred to as savants due to their extraordinary ability with memory or mathematics or art or a variety of other subjects. Statistically speaking, this is a very small percentage of the autistic population. There are other differences which are much more common. To quote an analysis from 2014 run by Laurent Matron, the model confirms that the autistic brain develops with enhanced processing of certain types of information, which results in the brain searching for materials that possess the qualities it prefers and neglecting materials that don't." End quote. This correlates with my personal experiences wherein I struggle to stay engaged with subjects which my brain isn't interested in, which is rarely in my control, and feel compelled to seek out the opposite. This may also be the source of hyper-focus and specialization of skills and or interests, as the strive to do something can result in us doing the same activity for long periods of time. The same psychiatrist and researcher, Matrone, also found in 2011 by analyzing data from the past 15 years that autistic people concentrate more brain resources on visual detection and identification and less on planning and impulse control than non-autistic people. The results suggest that, quote, enhanced perceptual processing is a core feature of neural organization in this population, end quote. Another study of his showed that autistic people are up to 40% faster at problem solving than non-autistic people. Many non-autistic people inherently believe that their brain is superior to our brains due to their internalized ableism. I wholly disagree with the assertion that we are inferior. I believe that both non-autistic and autistic minds all minds are equal. When it comes to autism, there is often much more below the surface than what you see, as with neurotypical people. Autistic people vary tremendously, as do neurotypical people. We differ in how we perceive the world, in our experiences, and that means we can learn from each other. You might not recognize the solution which is apparent to me, and vice versa, but you'd never hear my solution if you decided beforehand I had nothing worth contributing. The simple truth is that every human being has equal worth regardless of what they can or can't do. Every human being has equal worth regardless of how their brain works, their appearance, and any other factors. Autistic people may have relative strengths in some areas and difficulties in others, in a way which seems confusing or inconsistent to non-autistic people, so it's important to understand that and keep it in mind when interacting with us. Something which seems easy to you may be difficult for us, and something which seems difficult to you may be easy for us. Neither is better, just different. Well, thanks for tuning in, thanks for coming by, have a good day. Hey everybody, Ultimate Oddball here. If you want to stay up to date with my videos, click subscribe. I release a new video on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I do gaming commentary and review. I talk about my experiences on the autism spectrum, and I share my opinions and thoughts on a variety of matters. My hope is that, through my videos, I can help to dispel some of the misinformation, confusion, and negativity people have regarding autism. Thank you for helping me do that by watching these videos.